Prince Victoria Park is a Renaissance retirement development in Torbay on the English Riviera. There are 38 one and two bedroom apartments and they're split into two wings divided by the lovely glass entrance hall behind me. As you enter the development you go through this garden, the nice raised beds with shrubs and trees and it's such a lovely area to retire to. It's about a 10 minute walk to Paynton Beach, there's a park just behind the development and you have a good bus service to the shops from the end of the road. At Paynton you can take the steam train all the way to Kingsweir, from there you can take the passenger ferry to Dartmouth and then get the boat back at the end of the day. There's so much choice here, it's hard to know which apartment I would go for and although we can't show you them all today, hopefully we'll entice you enough to come and take a look for yourself. So the glass is a lovely feature from the outside, but as you enter it just fills this whole area with natural light. There are some double doors here that lead through to an owner's lounge. There's so much seating in there. If you have extended family, you could have birthday parties, but there will also be lots of social events and clubs, and you really can take it or leave it. There are double doors leading out to the garden and further seating, and also a kitchen so you can make teas and coffees while you're entertaining. At the other side of the building we also have the car parking area, there's another entrance foyer and there you have the concierge. They are there if you need them weekdays from 10 till 4 and then in the evenings you have the added peace of mind of the Tunstall 24 hour helpline. They answer within two minutes, can hear you from anywhere in the apartment and then you can also have a wrist strap or pendant if you need. In each wing there is a lift and stairs and even in the lift there's so much attention to detail with the finish, it's almost like being in a hotel and we are going to make our way all the way to the top floor. All of the apartments have a good sized storage cupboard with a washer dryer. Not all the apartments have stairs but this one leads to a rather impressive room which we'll look at a little later. In the bedroom here you have the glass that goes right the way up to the apex, great view over the garden and then in winter when the trees lose their leaves you can also see the park behind. The shower room here has oversized tiles, that drench a shower but also a handheld and you can turn the shower on and adjust the temperature before you go in. In the kitchen you have Caesar stone granite work surfaces, Neff appliances including an induction hob and then clever gadgets like the oven door that retracts away as seen on the Bake Off with Mary Berry. There is a video entry system so you can clearly see who's at the door before you let them in and all of these show apartments have been furnished differently to show you how versatile the layout is. Here you have a large dining table but you can also see in this apartment that you could have a smaller table in the window and all of your sofas still in this space allowing you to close the door and utilise the room behind me here as a study, another bedroom or a hobby room. This particular apartment has the unique feature of a mezzanine level, so we'll go up the stairs and take a closer look. Being in the roof space you have all of these unusual angles and then the roof light throws in lots of natural light. And in the ensuite you also have a light well, the mirrors are on sensors and there is a soft closed cupboard under the sink. The space behind me has been used for additional seating but I think equally it would make a rather impressive dressing area. So you can see that this apartment has lots of unique features that set it aside from the others but then some of the others have balconies. From the balcony here you have a great view over the garden. There are various different seating areas plus you can also dine al fresco and some of the apartments open straight out onto the garden have their own private patio. There is an owner's car so you can go on weekly excursions to places like Berry Head, St Mary's Bay and historic Brixham Harbour. And the walk along the breakwater is just beautiful and offers views the whole way across Torbay, plus there's a lovely little cafe at the end. Behind there is a park with a large duck pond, a great place to visit with the grandchildren. But you also have in addition to Paynton Beach, Goodrington Sands, Broad Sands and all the other beaches in Torbay at your disposal. Or you can just make a cup of tea in the owner's lounge, grab a good book, relax in the garden and enjoy your retirement.